I come from China. Uh, I used to be a professor of economics at Peking University, Department of Economics. And uh, I have been uh, promoting constitutional democracy, rule of law, individual freedom. And I criticize the party and the government for their policies and for institutions. I think in China, there must be uh, a big fundamental institutional change in the future. But it also needs a kind of the movement of the new citizens uh, that has the more information, data. And so in that sense, the censorship and the blocking of the internet uh, will be something we have to try to remove. Yeah, nowadays, the, the young people try to use a different kind of things, means to uh, overcome the censorship and the blocking. They might use uh, the mobile phone, they use uh, the individual social media to uh, uh, disseminate some information and ideas they have. And also, uh, they could be uh, they use a VPN or they use a kind of a tunnel or maybe it's a tunneling uh, software uh, to uh, overcome the firewall. Through our efforts, we are trying to establish uh, a new university. It's called the Tiananmen University of Democracy. Uh, the opening ceremony, uh, the command ceremony will be on June 1st in San Francisco, public library. So by that time, I think the more people will know this website, it's because it's a website uh, you, that the people in China, if they can uh, overcome the, the censorship of blocking, they probably will know the content and they can register to be our uh, students. Because our major uh, audience is the young people in mainland China. <laughs>